Two former main opposition lawmakers, An Chol Su and Chan Jung Bae, reunited today as part of a new opposition bloc, the People's Party. The two vowed to stand up against the ruling Senate Party, but will it be enough to unite liberal voters? Our Shin Se-min has more on the duo's resolve. Two minor opposition parties have merged, and a new coalition enters the rapidly changing political landscape in Korea. Independent lawmaker An Chol Su of People's Party and Chun Jung Bae of National Congress announced they will join for victory over the ruling Senri Party in the coming parliamentary elections in April. We share a common belief that the coalition should work in the interests of the people, not the politicians. The United Coalition upholds constitutional values and has a vision towards demographic reform. The coalition forms amid growing concerns that division within opposition circles may further split the progressive voters in the lead up to the general elections. Vowing to provide hope to the people, the new duo promised to unite with other lawmakers and attract more talent to the new party. The new coalition will remain as the People's Party, but the two politicians have yet to disclose specifics on the agreement or official launch date. The latest move by former main opposition party affiliated lawmakers An and Chun is bound to intensify the rivalry with Moon Jae-in, chair of the main opposition bloc Minju Party of Korea. A recent local pollster shows that An Chol Su's People's Party has been struggling with faltering approval ratings of just over 17 percent, losing support in the strategically important Southwest or Honam region. Now, with the new teamwork, he's hoping to win back some of the voters as the political roller coaster is likely to continue in the lead up to the general elections. Shin Se-min, Arirang News.